After having launched and now stood up on the board for the first time, you are ready to practice your first stroke. The paddle stroke should aim to be smooth and clean when entering and exiting the water, otherwise called the catch and release. The stroke should extend as far forward as possible, pulling the paddle vertical through the water. The stroke should start to exit the water when the blade is in line with your feet. Hold the paddle with your top arm gripping the handle and lower arm halfway down at the shaft of the paddle. To start the stroke, straighten your lower arm to enter the blade in the water. As you pull the paddle towards you, your top arm pushes downwards to dig the blade deep in the water. As the paddle reaches your feet, twist your wrist to allow the blade to exit through the water as it releases. Basic turn. To perform a basic turn while standing up, gently push as wide as you can and push from the tail of the board towards the nose. Keep knees bent for stability. Switch sides and pull the paddle from the nose to the tail to complete the turn. For the basic turn, avoid doing a really strong stroke when pushing from the tail to the nose as you can often lose your balance. Reverse paddle or crossbow turn. The crossbow allows you to turn efficiently by using your momentum without moving your footing. It can be used for both sides and is often used in racing as a more stable option to a step back turn. Build up momentum and then start by twisting your shoulders sideways, lifting the paddle across the nose of the board. Enter the blade as wide as possible and slowly use the power face of the blade to push your paddle towards the nose. As you do this, rotate your core and bend at the knees to generate the power in the stroke. Switch sides as you reach the nose and complete the turn by pulling the paddle from the nose to the tail. It is important not to twist the paddle when performing this stroke. Step back turn. The step back turn is a quick and powerful turn that can be applied in both race and surf. Step back with your preferred foot into a sideways stance. The further back you step, the faster you will turn. Keep your torso facing forwards and eyes fixed on the nose of the board to help keep your weight aligned and evenly distributed. Maintain a wide stance to help balance on the board. Bend your legs to increase stability. Paddle with a wide and strong stroke to turn the board. As you step forwards, bring the back foot forward again so that both feet are facing forwards. As you build confidence, you can cross step back into a parallel stance. 